Is it on? Whew, let's get comfortable. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so if you're watching this video, then you're probably fed up with your job too, right? Work a nine to five, you probably live in corporate America where you're just basically trying to make ends meet and you just feel like you're a zombie. So you essentially feel like you're just on repeat. You're living a repetitive life. You feel like you're lost in life. You don't know where to go next and you know that you have to pay the bills, but you just feel like is this really just what life is all about? I feel like I have no substance. <laughs> what is my purpose? You know what I mean? So let's get into it. How we got here. How I got here was always working multiple jobs at a time to make ends meet. I have always worked multiple jobs since I was a teenager. Um, my very first job was official job. <laughs> without a worker's permit with Six Flags when I was a teenager. Um, I always like found a way to find work and you know, some jobs I held on to for years for a long time. So I am no um, stranger to hard work and manual labor. You know, that's just what it is. But <sighs> that's not, that just can't be it for my life, you know? Um, it's one thing to want to make ends meet and it's another thing to just feel like you're you're just unalive on the inside and I don't want to feel like that anymore so making such a scary decision to leave the workforce I've been with my company now for a little while and I'm over I'm done like once you start to feel anxious, I've started to feel anxious about the job where I'm constantly thinking about it on the weekends. I'm constantly just dreading to clock in on Monday. Um, I can't, I'm losing sleep. I can't go to bed the night before. And you start to feel like you're losing sight on the bigger goal and they would get rid of you tomorrow and have your replacement today if it was up to them um and that's something for us to really remember we've gone through so much as a people you know that we should be able to do things that make us happy but honestly in the state of the world it's really hard to just survive you know the cost of living that they don't pay you um a livable wage anymore and you're just literally doing work just to make ends meet um, I don't want to live like that either <laughs> my goal right now is finding a part-time job that I truly love that I can do and make good enough money on the side while also being a full-time content creator I think that that is the best thing for me. I think that's the, I know that that is the best thing for me. I know that that is my journey. I know that's what I need to do in order to live a peaceful life and to not feel the constant anxiety and depression trying to creep up on me and get on my shoulders. Like I don't want to deal with that anymore. Um, I always recommend, you know, making decisions that are best for you, but like we have to be responsible at the same time. And it's like, who wants to be responsible? Like this job, like I don't want to be here anymore. Yes, I don't want to promote that ever. Like I've left jobs, trust me. I've left them before and I, I always try to make sure I have a backup plan. I have another job to go to, I know what I'm doing, but I feel like in this season of life, there's so many things that are just pushing me out of the job and pushing me into full-time content creation. And I'm like, well, what's holding me back at this point? Bills, bills, life, bills, bills. This water isn't even free. Water is not free. We're paying for something that's literally a natural resource. So there's that. Um, that should tell us all that we need to know about the state that we're living in currently. You know what I mean? So I'm keeping that in the forefront of my mind and telling myself to remain grounded while also making the changes. And you know, I've been applying to other jobs for the last six months. 
for the last six months, guys. I wasn't even monetized on YouTube. For the last six months, I've just been going full force, applying to other jobs and trying to see what comes out of it. And just nothing, nothing, nothing. The job market is not great, honestly. Not right now. It's not good. And um, I'm just working to find what my purpose is. And I feel like my purpose is my YouTube. My purpose is my content creation. I love doing what I do. And it makes me happy. And I feel like I'm being helpful to other people. So if being helpful to others in being able to create a safe community for other people and not just myself like if that's my purpose then that's exactly what i want that's exactly where i want to be and hopefully you know you guys can find like something that really takes your mind away from the constant like day-to-day -day clocking in working eight to ten hours clocking out and then just barely having enough energy to pour into yourself that's where I'm at now and it's like I'm just trying to get back to me and get to a better me so yeah <laughs> this is the beginning of a new era this is the beginning of my journey and if you guys want to see more then please be sure to click that subscribe button and subscribe be sure to thumbs this video up and comment down below what you guys want to see next also turn on those post notifications just so that you're able to keep up with this journey with Jay. And uh, let's see what this 2024 has in store for us, you guys. I feel like it's going to be greatness, big, wonderful things. I'm speaking only greatness um, into my 2024. I'm speaking only greatness into your 2024. And we got this, you guys. So let's do it. We'll do it together. This is our community. We're only going up from here. I'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao.